Hey man, it's the ISO guy sensei, the greatest nigga on 2K in existence. A new patch has dropped. We got a lot to talk about. Y'all especially want to watch this video and you want to share this to, to all the, uh, all the you know that play 2K because you could be hot in the future or you could have already been hacked. You might want to change your info, etc. But before we get into all that, y'all make sure y'all like the video. It's free. It requires minimal effort. Make sure y'all subscribe if you're new and turn on them post notice, man. It's supposed to be your moment. This supposed to be your moment. This supposed to be your moment. What good is being the one when you the only one that knows it? So look, man, we got a new patch, man. And it doesn't seem to be any gameplay stuff. I haven't heard anyone really talking about it. Maybe um, some people talked about it in a tweet. I'm gonna bring that up uh, later. But uh, they said debug menu option was patched, online game stability improvements, added network connection fixes. Um, the game, the game has been like kind of up. I think that's why 2K is not putting out official notes because the the launch of this uh 2K has been way more messed up than um probably the past well pro last year for sure. Not not 21. 21 was like broken as hell, especially on next. But um, people still getting blue screens, getting kicked out the wreck all the time. Animations keep switching like that. Four badges, you having it at the max and you not being able to max it is it's ridiculous, bro. Um, my NBA era rosters in play now in 2KU, no um, blacktop, no longer available. The general stability fixes. Um, a lot of people always talk about how dribbling so delayed, and it definitely is, man. Especially when you play online, um, they 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 gotta fix that, bro. It's 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 too delayed. It's annoying as hell, man. And yeah, just performance and other minor fixes. Who knows what they really patch, man? Anywho, so 2K support tweeted this out. I don't know why NBA 2K didn't share this on their page. It, this is what I mean, bro. They don't want bad publicity. That's why I tell all y'all creators to speak up. They don't want it. There's a reason, man. Like, you know, they, they, they did it on 2K support because it's their obligation, but you ain't see NBA 2K retweet this. But yeah, they're basically saying earlier today, we became aware that an unauthorized third party illegally accessed the credentials of one of our vendors. The unauthorized party sent a communication to certain players containing a malicious link. Please do not open any emails or click any links that you receive from two, the 2K Games support account. Okay, share this message, this video. Very important, man. I don't want y'all. We already getting finessed by 2K. Now you're going to lose your account <laughs> from all that money you spending. Then he said, uh, if you have already clicked on this link, we recommend immediately taking the following steps, you know, for caution. Reset any user account password stored in your web browser, Chrome Autofill. Y'all should know what Chrome Autofill is. Um, enable multi-factor authentication you know two-step all that bullshit they're saying to install an antivirus program and remove everything suspicious and it says please no we'll, we'll never ask you for your password or personal information so if they ask you that they trying to finesse you man smarten up dog anywho man this jp guy tweeted out after the patch happened he says, uh, him running off ball, he lost adrenaline bars. And you know, he's very upset that on defense, he can hold R2 as long as he wants, but even when he's off ball with the ball, he's losing adrenaline. I think this is very dumb. Me personally, it's like, damn, your game so ass that you gotta like, really like, make the game so unrealistic, but claim it's realistic. <laughs> like who has adrenaline bars in real life? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? These are athletic gods, 0.001% of the humanity on steroids. You telling me like they they blinky? They all of them got asthma? <laughs> Man, they just ain't want to fix their defense and pay pay for a new engine. Leak, 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 leak. But yeah, man, I think that's that's definitely dumb. But he's saying maybe he notices it more. I don't know, man. Um someone else said it. Uh Jazz said it. And he says he thought it was a glitch. Um, there's a way around this. Um, I'll tell y'all in another video on how to do it and really not lose your adrenaline. It's a little exploits. So I'll put y'all on. Um, I, me personally, bro, 
I just don't like how they have to slow down and make the offense so slow and all these different type of restrictions just so they can have the illusion that defense is in their game. This is why they slowed everything down and added all these restrictions, bro. Because <laughs> they couldn't fix defense. And I don't think a company should be praised for that. I, I ain't gonna hold you, man. And then, and then they try to hide under realism, man. Bro, I love basketball, man. Uh, th this 2K23 is extremely unrealistic, bro. It might be the most unrealistic 2K ever, but everyone is saying that it's realistic. It's crazy to me. Do you have adrenaline bars in real life? Answer, like, like be, be for real, be for real. I know, I know y'all love the game. It's, it's okay, we, we all have our vices, man. But bro, there ain't no stamina restriction in a game to 21, especially if you're a human demigod, if you're the Hercules of <laughs> real life, and there ain't no adrenaline bullshit, bro. Like, come on, bro. Come on. And I'm not no left-right defender or play shot nigga. Like, like you know, I use a, you know, I always use meta builds, but come on, let let's, let's be around. Let's be around. Anywho, Nate X he talks about the game, man. Let's see what he has to say about 2K23. He is exposed. He is exposing 2K23 for having. No skill gap. Um, let's hear about it. Everybody in this game now is <laughs> is, is running a six nine lockdown like a speed boost and slash. It's it's so hey. hard. To hey, that's good. It's realistic. The best players in the world are around these heights. First of all, for all of y'all um, people who like to bash two K fifteen, two K twenty three having a lot of fifteen attributes. You know, but y'all hate 15, but you love 23. Just say you didn't play it. And you mad that people used to say, oh, you was ass in 15. That, that's why you bashed that hoe. But um, back in 15, bro, we were using these height builds. We could play defense, guard our own man, dribble extremely well, and we could shoot. And before patch four, the shooting was harder than 2K23, 22, 21. 19 and 18 but y'all don't know about that y'all just look at clips and you know y'all y'all think you know it used to be hard to score 40 in the wreck when you were like amazing but yeah man i definitely think it should be hard for nade to uh stop these type of players because he uses a stretch big bro and he want to dex with like a big inside like that's his play style that shit is ass bro <laughs> we'll beat that shit Two ISO players who yeah. have lock badge. Two guards. They, they they used to say back in the day, two guards, two cards. Niggas used to activate two cards when you pulled up on twos with two guards, nigga. Niggas was toxic. Can slash, can shoot. Mm. They have an 85. But but y'all hear the what what they like to say when they promote the game and like they keep saying the sacrifice and no more demigods. It's just looking like the demigods is alive and well. I ain't gonna hold you, bro. Like, what a quote unquote, what the demigod is basically, like everyone says, it's being able to do anything. And it, look, these big players can do any and everything. So I don't, I don't really be getting people, man. It's just like how people try to hide and say like 2K23 realistic. Just, I wish people you would use different words instead of just using words to, uh, to just hide under, you know? Three-pointer, and they can rim run their ass off. They're so fucking, they're literally like Usain Bolt. <laughs> Either case. I, I fuck with it, I ain't gonna hold you. This down needs to be patched, well, like, it needs nah, to be buffed. No, you know, shit does no, not work. No. Steals need to be nerfed. Nah, fuck that chase down shit. You get in front of a nigga, that shit should, you know? You should have to be in front of him. If you're in front, and he's still scoring on you, then that's a problem. You know, pain defense is still ass. They, they, they gotta fix it. Because everybody just spams X with a log and gets a steal right away. Look, this is a stretch big saying that uh, everyone's getting ripped, man. You know, I talked to some stage players. Niggas told me they average three turnovers a game, nigga. And that they're just, they're just getting auto animations. But then, you know, everyone's worried about, damn. If you get it patched, then it's going to turn into 
not being able to get a steal. So what's worse, being able to get steals or not being able to get? It's like guards already got nerfed with the movement, the speed boost, the dribbling, the adrenaline, a lot of different things. And it's like now, like it's it's back to where someone can come up to you, tap square, and just rip that whole super RNG. <sighs> Baluba, you got to learn to balance your game, man. It, it, a no-skill player shouldn't be able to rip me, especially if I'm in takeover, dog. It, it's, I don't know, man. Doesn't matter what your ball control is. So, bro, like, dudes be like, Nate, you be complaining. Yeah, people even tested it with Hall of Fame Unpluckable, like league players, man. So fucking much. I'm like, bro, the game is broken when it comes to these builds. You know what I'm saying? And then, and then you have these... Maybe it just don't suit Nate playstyle because he always be using some super broken shit. Like, <laughs> come on, man. Stretch big to center. Come on. On 17, 18, 19, bro, them, them, them like super unrealistic decks and back and forth. I, I don't know, bro. That shit broken as hell to me. Uh, the 7 1 post score and uh, I agree with the stretch. Score shit. It's OP as fuck. Whoever makes a 7 1 post stretch is a demon this year. Oh, God. But yeah, man. Anywho, man, y'all let me know what y'all noticed down below about the patch in the coming days. Come back to this video if you figure something else out that was patched or touched or that you think should be patched and touched. Comment it down below. And um, y'all make sure y'all follow me on Twitch. Link in description. If you want help with your builds. You want to see some immaculate, hilarious gameplay. And look, join my YouTube channel, the member link, become a member to the channel, man. If you want to get added to the friends list, 1v1, all that hoobla. That link is also in the description. Or it's like right next to the sub button. I don't know, man. Appreciate y'all, nigga. Comment I if you made it this far. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here we go again. People talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm that made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.